Hello, Gamer Gnome is back. And in this video, we're going to help this noob with the rework Gravity Fruit reach max level. But before we start, you can show your support by using star code Gamer Gnome when purchasing your Robux. 5% of the earnings will go to me, and this will really help us on making better videos. With the actor slam. Oh, they're dancing forward. That's your slam. That's the dump. And for those who don't know, I already made a video of the Nuka Pro Gravity Fruit from level 1 to 700. So guys, I will put the link in the description just in case you want to watch a more detailed one. I'm going to make this one faster and we're gonna focus on the second and third C. Okay guys, so let's start. First, you need to level up from 1 to 15 with the bandits. You're gonna use your Z skill, Gravity Push. And when you reach again level 15, we will now move to our next island. And that island is the Fountain City. So the target here is the Gali Pirates. You're gonna use the wall strat. Don't worry guys, there is no damage as long as there is a wall in between you. So guys, you're gonna use your M1 for initial damage and your gravity push to last hit. This is how it looks like. There you go, lots of masteries. Okay, so the goal here is level 55, again from level 15. You will reach 55 here, and after that, you will unlock your boulder flight. This F skill sucks, so just use a bolt, guys, but for you, I will use this. Next island is the Pirate Village. Target is Clown. You're gonna defeat this one until you reach level 16. So guys, just dodge his skill, use Z skill to defeat him, and that's it. For the stats, melee defense 15, blocks fruits 153. Next island is the desert, target desert bandits until level 75. After that, next up, the desert officers until level 90. Next island is the frozen village. Don't forget to buy everything the ability teacher sells, the sky jump, the enhancement, and the flash step. Next up, the snow bandits. You're gonna grind here until you reach level 105. After that is the boss in this island, Yeti. So you're gonna start doing server up here until you reach level 130. We're gonna skip the snowman and the galley pirates on the next island. So before we move on to the next island, let's do some stat check first. 35 melee defense, blast fruits 320. Next island is the marine fortress. Guys, don't forget to buy the black cape. One of the best early game item. So our target here is Vice Admiral. Guys, you will unlock your X skill, my favorite skill. The Gravity Obeisance. There you go, just hold X to maximize the damage. Again, our target here is 220. And yes, you're gonna do server hop. Next island is the Prison. You're going to grind here until you reach level 350. Guys, the Warden, the Chief Warden, and the Swan. Same strategy, you're just gonna do wall strat and then server hop, okay? So again, our target level here is 350. And after that, next village is the Magma Village. So here our target is the Magma Admiral. Same strategy, server hop until 425. Guys, technique, just dodge that attack and use your ZNX skill. Okay, so at 425 or 426, for our account, check stats first, melee defense 135, block fruits 1008. Next up is the underwater city. Our get mob is the fishman lord and target level is level 500. For the strategy guys, we're gonna do wall strat. Okay, so it's very easy, just lure him on a wall and then defeat him. Okay, so at level 500, next island is the skylands, upper sky. Yes, we're gonna skip again, lots of mobs. Target is the whisper and strategy is the stone strat. Just go on top here, he cannot damage you. See that guys? The bazooka cannot damage you, so easy kill. You will unlock your C skill, the meteor pitch. This is the meteor pitch, there you go. And you're gonna do server up until 625. After that, final island, the Fountain City. Again, target is the Gali Pirates. So guys, they're very easy to defeat since we have three skills. Guys, no cyborg. We're gonna skip the galley captains and we're gonna skip the raiders on the second sea as well as the mercenaries. So guys, you're gonna leave this area at 775. Let's check our stats first before we move on to the second sea. There you go, melee defense 250, blast fruits 1825. Now head to the middle town. 
There you go. Don't forget to buy Observation Hockey first, okay? Now, for our target, the Swan Pirates, we're gonna skip the Diamonds, the Factory stuff, as well as Jeremy, and the whole green zone, except for Fajita. Good news, we're going to unlock the Meteor Rain, the V-Skill. This is how it looks like. Guys, you can control the Meteors, okay? So now, a better skill for grinding. So again, at level 925, we are moving to our next island. The green zone, again, we're gonna target Fajita. So this is a gravity versus gravity fruit user fight. So we're gonna do server up here until you reach level 1000. By the way, did you notice that his fruit is not uh, reworked? <laughs> Sad Fajita. Okay, for the stats, here you go. Melee defense, 350. Block fruits, 2300. Next up is the snow mountains. Our only target is the snow troopers here. Just one X and V skill and that's enough. Check it out. V and X skill. There you go. Easy grind. Our target here is level 1150. And after that... Next island, hot and cold. Our only target here is Smoke Admiral. Guys, damage check. 1V, X, and Z skill. And he is almost dead. Let's check his HP. There you go. 14k damage, almost half. So guys, just two sets of skills. And that's it. Target level here is level 1250. And after that, next island is the Cursed Ship. Our only target here is the ship deckhands. Guys, you can do wall strat here. I'm gonna show it to you. There you go. Easy grinding, right? Our target level here is 1350. And yes, we're gonna skip all the mobs. Because why not, right? It's very easy to grind with the ship deckhands for the stats. Here you go. Max black fruits. That's the most important thing. Next up is the ice castle target arctic warriors guys you need three skills to defeat this mobs which is really easy there you go so again at 1400 you can start defeating the ice admiral with the wall strap so here you go just lure him here in the wall and that's it again very easy to defeat there you go you might get hit but it's fine guys if ever you get the library key just use it here on this door and you will see an npc and you can get the death step here okay so again, what I did is I did server hop until I reached 1,475. After that, Forgotten Island. And target is the Tide Keeper until 1,500. Guys, if ever you get the water key, that's the same with the library key. You just need to give it to Tide Rock if you want to get the Shark Man fight style or something like that. <laughs> okay, so at 1,500, here are the stats. Melee, 600. Defense, 1-5. Blast Fruits, Max. Okay, don't forget to do the Coliseum quest. Beat Indra. And after that, head to the green zone to go to the third C. Congratulations, guys. Final C. So after this, our target, the Pirate Millionaires. You need three skills to defeat them. There you go. It's kind of hard here, to be honest. But there you go. We were able to grind here. And the target level is 1,675. After that, next stop, Hydra Island. Target is Island Empress. Strategy is the wall strat. So guys, you're gonna do server up here. It's very easy here. There you go. Just defeat her until 1,750. Oh, there's an enemy after this. Let's run, 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 run. <laughs> okay, moving on. Let's say we've reached 1,750. Next island is the Great Tree. Our target here is Kilo Admiral. Strategy, guys, is Stone Strat. Guys, as you can see, I'm on top of the stone. I can damage him with the V skill, T skill, and the Z skill. Okay? So there you go. Easy kill. Server hop until 1,800. After that, next island is the Floating Turtle. And our only target is the Fishman Captains. Why? Because they're near each other. The quest giver is very near. So guys, we're gonna grind here until 1,975. After that is a Haunted Castle, only target Reborn Skeletons. Why? Same reason with the with the Fishman Captains. Our target here is 2,075. There you go. Here are the stats. Max Defense and Blast Fruits. All the remaining stats will go to melee. And there you go guys. Final Island, Sea of Treats. Target Peanut Scouts until level 2,200. Okay, why? Again, same reason with the Fishman Captains. At 2,200, we'll move to the next island where the Cookie Crafters are located, yes. Another 100 levels here. They don't have long-range attacks, so it's a free hit as long as you maintain distance. 
So again, at level 2300, we will move to the new final island and defeat Coco Warriors until max level. So guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Next week, I will post a Doe Fruit 1 to Max Awakened. So guys, better watch out for that. And again, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you all. This is Gamer Nom, and Gamer Nom out.